Oh, I feel so invigorated. Like I'm, I'm a brand new wolf. It's the best. I'm uh, 200 years younger all over again. You don't look it. That's <laughs> fucked up. That's, <laughs> you could have held the illusion for one second. Sorry. Let me ride with it. I it's okay. It's a first no, there are not even any mirrors around. Oh, no, Fuck that. Do you feel like you have more control in the moment? No, oh. not anymore. I guess I just have memory loss. You know, I'm just all mm. senile now. Don't let her get to you, Chetney. This is a, an amazing achievement. You know, she's probably just a little cranky because she was dead a couple days ago. Mm. Oh, that's true. Yeah. I should have consideration. Yeah. But I put myself in other people's shoes. Put other, you put yourself in other people's dead shoes. Yeah. FCG, that is so wise. You're you're right. You're absolutely right. I'm sorry, Ladna. Do you want to try yeah. my shoes on? I bet they look cute on you, actually. Do you have very small feet? Mm. <laughs> I don't know. Compared to you, I don't know. These are cur the curls on the shoes. That's where my toes go. Oh, those are actual <laughs> toes. Yes, yeah, it took me 250 <laughs> years to cultivate the grow. Wow, yep. it's not it's not a uh, toenail. It's your actual. What a way to find out. Wow. <laughs> Take off your shoes. No, they're already off. I just bury uh -oh. my toes in the dirt every time we stop. <laughs> <laughs> it's like running around in scuba fins. <laughs> <laughs> so old. I felt so young this morning that Lada fucked me up. <laughs> you see, Minad has looks to be some sort of an odd forest rabbit, but it has these like long, kind of curled horns that come out of the front of its mouth, and its back legs have these heavy claws. It's just kind of hanging as he drags it behind. Is it a wear rabbit? It's not a wear rabbit. It's a breakfast rabbit. Throws it over to you. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you'd catch it. I didn't. I'm sorry. I didn't. Uh, what the hell? Uh, I, <laughs> it in the face. <laughs> I feel like shit. I, uh, I'm gonna. That was the oh, one. You look like the one that catches things. You're right. That's on me. I'm gonna. I mean, I just walks off in the forest, oh, super embarrassed. Oh, <laughs> it's the hot one. Thanks for the. Rabbit. I think we're, we're learning too many lessons too quickly. I think we should just take it a little more slowly this morning. A little nubbin? There you go. That's a tart. I get out pate. I just shove it in his oh. ribs. <laughs> there you go, buddy. Oh, I just woke me right up, didn't he? I, woke me. <laughs> I just want to know. I don't know if you have one, so I thought maybe you'd want one. Well, let's give it a shot. Does it work? <laughs> just falls out and he's like, oh, oh. Well, it was worth a shot, eh? <laughs> we'll work on it. No! <laughs> <laughs> I think kind of tickles. Really bad. <laughs> what are you stroking? The meat tongue. I'm pulling off the skin. <laughs> it's not cool. I'm pulling out the tongue of the rabbit. <laughs> <laughs> do, do rabbits have toes? They must have toes. Sure. Yeah, they could have toes. Tiny little toes. Do you want to see that on the end of your it's big so one? Where actual out. tongue? Yeah. What is happening? Like a tongue chain? With time? <laughs> all of this. Oh. Orm is going to move off uh, a ways from the group and uh, he... I'm going to move away. He, <laughs> and he leaves. Orm just leaves. <laughs> He's done. <laughs> I tried with this new blade and gets to know it for a while and he starts slow and then it gets quicker and quicker and at a certain point his shield hand, uh, he points it out at like a, a small log on the ground and a vine shoots out oh. Spider-Man style to the log and he what? yanks it into the air and then slashes with the blade and even though the log is like 20 feet in the air, it gets cut in half as soon as Orem swings. God bless God reach. Oh. And he just quietly is smiling at God bless blade. Your blade is cool. Thanks. How's it feel being alive again? Mm. Sorry, I just jumped right in. No, you didn't. Did. That, that was, no, was very <laughs> light and jovial. Mm -hmm. and then that just, I was trying to make it just, work. just get it in right yes. quick. I mean, it feels incredible, and I'm still of grappling with the such extreme lengths you all went to get me back, but um, I'm still not entirely sure if there's still a piece of Delilah lingering in there, and certain things I'm still just unsure of, and I'm not easily afraid of things. So kind of afraid of myself. I understand. Sometimes it goes well, and other times it's like, oh, oops. Y yes. I, I didn't like that woman very much. I think we can all do whatever we can to, to keep her away. I think you fought her pretty well from the inside. Couldn't have done it without her for you. I feel pretty terrible that I flipped a coin for your lives. I'm sorry. I didn't want to make the decision myself, and then it felt so flippant and terrible. 
Well, let's blame it on a god. Yeah. <laughs> I support the decision. Well, I'm very glad you're back. Me too. I missed you terribly. I don't really have anything that can, like, go boom and target uh, just a bunch of people all at once. And so, I wouldn't mind learning to play with a little bit of fire, <gasps> maybe? I would absolutely love to help with that. Yes. Oh, this gives me a bit of a project. I love you this. Know. I think you're going to be amazing at it. I okay. think aesthetically it's going to be very cool. You think so? Yes. All right. Definitely will add to it. Usually what I do, rub my fingers together okay. and gets real hot. Oh, you're flaking a little bit. <gasps> Some pieces are coming up. It's, it's been the, okay. the jungle's not been good for the. Do this little action. Think fire in, in your head. See the big flame. You blow it out to your fingertips, and then you should get some fire. Maybe you just try it at me. Oh boy. All right. I can just. Yeah. You, it's fine. Yeah. We, I can take it. Can you maybe like catch it? Mister kind of climbs in your shoulder and was like, <laughs> gets excitement in yeah, his eyes. It. It's fine. He ignites in flames. <gasps> As you imagine in your head the start of a match, a crackle of a fire as it begins to burn into a furnace, an inferno, a raging forest fire, molten volcano eruption, just all the elemental imagery of what fire means in the history of Exandria. You open your eyes just in time to see the very tips where the connections of your fingers are. There's this faint orange glow between them. And as you separate them slightly, all those little tips of glow go fit into one small little bead, a fast-moving moat on the wind. Harold's oh, tiny. Okay. Over towards you, Fern. It's a little one. Mister, just grab it. <laughs> he chomps on it. <laughs> An explosion of flame completely engulfs both him and Fern in a 20-foot radius. <laughs> All the nearby trees that were covered in morning dew and mist are now scorched, and there is a vacant spot. The warmth has completely eliminated the surrounding mist and fog. It's, it's, it's okay. Up. It's happening. Oh, oh, God. So, oh God. Uh, Everything is scorched, but there are no flames catching. Thankfully, it is a moist enough jungle, and the flame is immediate enough that it didn't catch. However, you do 8d6 fire damage to Fern. 8d6. <laughs> I thought we were just going to start small. You're a practice oh, sorcerer. There's no Give dialing down a fireball. Eight. Yeah. 25, 25 points of fire damage. Oh, no. You're used to the bright, vibrant oranges and reds of you know nature-based fire. It comes towards you, the red ember turns to a dark purplish color, and as it detonates, the flames that surround you in a flash are a deep black purple coloration. <gasps> You caught it! <laughs> I did. Y'all all right? Yes, oh, yes. Are we, <laughs> are we attacking each other again? No, 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 We were just having Practicing. a lesson, and turns out Ladna's very extremely powerful and good at it already. So, that was amazing. <laughs> I didn't even know I could teach. This was so fun. We should do more classes. Okay. <laughs> okay. Maybe the next lesson could be in like in an open field, though. Or are you all sure. right? Do you want me to heal you? Can we go a day without killing one of one each one of each other? Yeah. Well, this was, you know, um, I'm gonna take a little bit of a nap on the ship. It's fine. A little bit of a nap. When you your hair is all gone, what? You are that is not true. Well, <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I see it here. <laughs> Your oh, eyebrows it's, just the, are gone. it's just the back of it. Just the <laughs> it's all gone. Oh. The front is. Well, yes, this is, it's no. a little patchy back there. You know, when you teach, when you're an amazing teacher, you do know that sometimes you're going to take a little bit of the heat. Nice. And if you have an amazing student, I mean, goes, what are you going to do? It just goes with the territory of teaching. You just yeah. got to take. It's fine. I'm just going to take a nap. Wondrous pyromaniacal deadliness. Like Beavis and Butthead. Yeah, Corn. straight up. Fire. 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 Look forward to making our way back here one of these days. I hope so. <laughs> Lugs the hammer up onto her right. shoulder. <laughs> walks over to you as as you begin to see now the sky ship is. I have a question. I just kind of saddle up to her knee. <laughs> um, Uther was with the Claret Order. He was before he. Had... Do you know why he left? He left a wound on his past. The place he once called home, he, he did enough damage where it was no longer home. You'll see a recurring theme in our kind of nomadic misfits. Part of this journey is learning how to stop shitting where we sleep. Only matters if you care where you sleep. Kind of new for me. Thank you. Uh, Fern. Yes. Just wanted to say good luck to you and your friends out there. And uh, I don't know, you know, just um, you know, just uh. <laughs> 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 yeah, crisp sauce. <laughs> You left the 
<laughs> have to straighten her on too long. Yeah. It smells a little weird, but I don't think that's me. I just wanted, wanted to you know, say, tell everyone for us, you know, good luck, and um, you're always welcome to come back and uh, visit Benak anytime. Oh, I will, uh, yeah. I will. Is the invitation just open for all, all the time? Yeah, yeah, just any time you want to come on by. I can get, I can get some more rabbits. <clears throat> all right, that sounds like fun. Great. Yay. <laughs> and he just darts off. Bye, Manad! Did that oh, happen? uh, oh. bye, Jenny, good luck! We're welcome back here anytime. <laughs> what did you write? She just, just Manad. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't finish might... my sentence oh, yet. Oh, 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 He's yeah. circling yeah. it over and over. Are you making a kill list? Are you all right? <laughs> because it looks like, is that part of the burn? Or is that just re the reddening of your flesh there? What, what is that? Oh, it might be the reddening of my flesh. Because of the of the the horrific burn you received, or maybe a little bit of both. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. You are the most chill burn victim I've ever met. <laughs> I'm just really proud of my student. I don't know what to say. <laughs> just. I'm gonna take a little bit of a nap. Sure. Yeah, you need some rest. Sleep off that burn. <laughs> yeah, that's how it works. Yeah. That's how it works. The hospital and see the people sleeping off their burns. <laughs> Handful of distant faces of the Gorgine kind of looking up before they charge back into the jungle, and you can just barely hear the echoing distant sound of <laughs> as they just go rushing. <laughs> <laughs> just Jenny on the side of the ship. <laughs> 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 that right down there? Yeah, that's uh, Koreo. Koreo. Q O R E O. North Korea or South Korea? <laughs> Damn it. Every time. Two seconds. Two seconds. And just because Marisha does not take notes, how do you spell EOS? We got it already. Danny just told us. It's y, y I O S. Yeah, like I said. Yeah, it is not at all how I ever I, spelled it. I've been spelling it with an E. Yeah, I like too. E better. I'm going to keep spelling it. No, I like it with a Y. It's cool. No, with no, I'm doing Y E O S. No. That's what I've been doing now. Oh, no. That's like. Pretty. Yos. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Yos. Yos. Welcome. Can you uncuff me? How about an awakening, Shedney? Hold on. Do I have keys? They're under my body. <laughs> All right. Oh. It's Velcro. You just pull. Don't stick on that. Velcro. Keeping it together, Popeye. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I made this for you, and I hold out this same crude little wolf that was like three quarters done uh, 36 hours ago, but now it's done. It's not amazing, but it does look like a wolf. This is truly awful. It's, it's, <laughs> it's really, really bad. True. It's the thought that counts. And if you just stick with it for a couple hundred years, we could refine this into something that could be a paperweight. It's not even paperweight worthy now? Not yet. We're not going to show this to anybody <laughs> because I don't want to affect your ego, okay? <laughs> but listen, it's, it's the gesture and you and I can cultivate this. It's a good starting point. Plus, basically trying to use an ax on... A finesse. I'm using I a short sword. It's really hard. It's hard. Yeah. Did you cut yourself a lot? Three times last yeah. night. And I take out one of my hook chisels. Mm. This one is good for both uh, curves, a little indentation and pressure work, and just an overall shape. Now, wrap your thumb while you're getting used to it, because usually you can ride the blade on this just a little bit. So try not to do that and see where it takes you. If you don't want to roll in somewhere with your big short sword, you can just keep this in your hand and then open somebody's neck up, and it works a lot easier. I was going to ask, how many people have you killed with this thing? I'm not so great with counting that high. Wow, and you're 100 No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, I, I haven't killed anybody with this one yet. Well, I'll see if I can get up to paperweight status on the next one. But this stays with me, only because we don't want anybody else to see it. It's true, I don't want the others to see it. This went about as well as I expected it to. It's good, <laughs> it's good. Did you sign it? Should I? Well, yeah, you gotta leave a mark or initials or something. Oh, man. It doesn't have to be letters, it could be anything. Everyone's telling me to name things lately. Look at my sword! I pull it out, and it, there's just like vines, tendrils going all up my forearm, holding it in place. Look at this thing! I have a, it's, the gods are watching! <laughs> I cover his face ah! like Spider-Man in vine ah! from seven feet away, <laughs> and I pull him in close. It does all kinds of stupid shit now. We're pretty much unstoppable now. We're gods. Okay. <laughs> Basically. <laughs> 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 
Imogen just jumps up. Yeah. <laughs> For like no reason. Yeah. She just hit the ground in human shape. <laughs> oh, wow. You can see as the sun's slowly beginning to set uh, away from that and the coloration of the sky changes, you can see there is a very large lake. That there is Lake Goron. That's the lake that sits in the center of Aeshanador. That's the lake that Eos is built upon. And right there on the northern side of it, we're just going to see it right before we even get there. That's to be Arowadi. That's the fishing village on the north side of the lake. Why? <laughs> oh, no. How do you spell A-R-U-A-T-I. Oh, I was so close. I was way off. I was, I was way super off. off. I was one letter off. <laughs> <laughs> and was it Lake Goron? K-O-R-O-N. K-O-R-O-N, thank you. Spelled it with a Q, because the other was a Q. Corio? Goron? Corio is with a Q? Yep. Yes. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> there, will, there will be a write-up later. I mean, I just wait. I wait for my spelling for the write-up. Put a name that's just a guess Matt's oh, spelling. Oh, spelling. Are you daring to press? I love it. I love it. These more apostrophes. <laughs> and vowels. Aruwadi is actually A R U A T apostrophe I. Oh, gosh. No, there it is. It's not. The entire country of Wales is going, what? <laughs> problem. Well, yeah. And you can see already, like as you get closer and closer to the village, looking over top of it, a number of fishing vessels kind have of scattered out beyond the docks on the south side of the village as you continue in that southward direction. You can see torchlights are coming on throughout the city as it gets darker and darker. Where the southern side of the city, there is a large bridge. Two, three miles of bridge continues out into the lake before it hits a little hub, a little like station with towers, and then continues on still that has elements that go in deep under the water, but it is like an over the surface of the water like a straight bridge. Along it, there are lantern lights that are just kind of aglow. And you can see now as the it's shipping into nighttime, they're starting to be lit. There are people that their job is to go down and light them in procession. The massive cluster of buildings and lights. Up and there it is. Eos, city of flow and light. Looks like we came at the right time of the day too. As it gets darker and darker, and the name begins to kick in, at least the meaning of it. As the sunlight vanishes, the flowing waters of the lake, especially around the edges and on the outside of the city where it's moving, glow a faint blue, like there's just a natural glowing essence around the edges of the water movement. Just a natural illumination to it. And two other bridges carve off to the east and western sides of it. Connect the central city. Eos sits in the middle of this lake, built on top of it. Gentle turquoise blue light magically swirls and shifts around the edges of the water. It stops at like a dam partway and then steps down. And then a little ways beyond that, it steps down. This is a three tiered lake. And where these dams are set, there's these like massive sluices that are built, towers and encampments along these bridges and at these breaks. You can see all manner of boats out and about. This is a vibrant, unique fishing based lake city. And for a fishing city, it is massive. You can see where these steps are. Are. There is built dam elements of it, and there are areas where it is white capped to let flow over into these waterfalls. At the very edges, as you begin to go over the first part of the step, you can see there is like a boat ramp that actually that comes down off the side where boats can eventually ride down to the lower. Oh, 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 oh no. You made it descending going into the city. Like this There's shape. a bridge above it. And then another like yeah. lower area, and then a lower area. And the city is built across those three elements. And the city you now see is comprised of three rings on each of these levels. Almost like the, bit, the city itself is multiple tiers where these different transitions occur. And as you get closer and closer, you can see where the water is shifting. And all that bright blue coloration is moving with it, flowing, swirling, like the entire lake, now that most of the sun is gone, it looks like it's some sort of an ethereal incantation, like magical energy. It's just arcane soup that surrounds the city that lights it from underneath. The perimeter walls, all the docks, the numerous docks that dot the exterior of it, are all gently lit by their proximity to the flowing water. City of flowing light. That there's the lake cap skyport and lounge. <laughs> <laughs> that's where we're gonna be uh, locking up, and that's where, uh, while you do your business, I'm gonna spend some money. <laughs> kind of a partial uh, lounge, partial casino, partial, uh, you know, in. We don't come here too often, but when we do, we make a time of it. Don't you wanna know? <laughs> um, <laughs> Mm. What's, your what's your name? What's your what's uh, your card? Dice or colors or cards? That's all of them, I think. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so count cards by smelling them. <laughs> I've never tried. Mm. <laughs> that would be awesome. First time for well, anything. Like first, you you like you mark them real quick. 
and then slip them back into the deck. You keep the cards on the table. Oh, okay. Yeah. You just give a little squirt to each, <laughs> each one. Oh, it smells like a 16. There's no 16 in the deck of cards. This is Exandria. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> go, I'm gonna go, order go. some calamari. Uh, From a casino? <laughs> <laughs> That's one way to go. The shelf is it's a, it's a If we just get over the negative shelf. one to all your skills, you really just want to go right back to that. <laughs> right back to that. Maybe right. they're a lake squid, I don't get know. Get some breakfast sushi while you're at it, Jesus. Yeah, I think yeah. you just cut loose what happens in the lake oh, cab. Oh, you came down here too! Skyport and Lounge stays in the lake cab, Skyport and Lounge. <laughs> <laughs> and tavern. <laughs> <laughs> and tavern and casino. Uh, There's not many places to get into rough and tumble, oh, well, that's I what mean, you're asking. And I'm just this not, is, not this stuffy. This is a place of learning. This is, this is, this is an illuminated cityscape. So like a good view then, just something, something I can take home. Steps aside and gestures to the window about five feet from him that overlooks a beautiful view of the It city. does look, yeah. These people just make me a little stuffy. Okay, okay. Can you step outside? <laughs> Excuse me, where do you get your drugs? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, <laughs> it's spice. Oh, do you plan on gambling? I've already lost a hundred gold. <laughs> <laughs> I love games, but I haven't really gambled much because most places I go into, if I ever try to gamble, they'd be like, ah, oh, get out, ah. But Tate, he can go invisible, and I can see through Pate's eyes, and I could send you messages. If there's anything in terms of like looking at other people's cards or looking to stack the deck, as they say in the gambling world, do they say that? I don't know, but I'm really excited. I'm sorry, just throwing it out there. I'm, I'm in. How long does Pate stay like that? Oh, he just sort of just disappeared for a while. What about great. The Can you make sure he doesn't do that? Although, you know, I just <laughs> I'm mindful of getting kicked out the first night, <laughs> the first hour of us hmm. being here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we just can't get caught. <laughs> yep, pretty much. Well, it's up to you. The option is there. Mm -hmm. So, Orm, you do note mm -hmm. with your passive perception of infinity that she's cheating at dots and boxes. <laughs> uh, yes, there is that. <laughs> so, uh, bitch. It's only because I can read his thoughts and know exactly. What yeah, he's it is. Go you are one of the worst people to play <laughs> those sort of games with. Uh, <laughs> I need to see what you have to bring. Take out pet. Hey. <laughs> Hello. Oh, my puppy, can't you see me? And he's like, I don't even see your mouth move on now. My patrilicism, it's, it's, um, <laughs> it's incredible. It's I, it's another card for Chocolate martini, chocolate <laughs> martini. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, having a good salmon night. Salmon sandwich, <laughs> Jason! <laughs> <laughs> Why a salmon sandwich? As soon as, as, soon as Lana uh, slurs her speech, Orm shoots a vine up at the ceiling and starts to do silk work. Oh, God, uh, right here in the around. casino, huh? Yep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Absolutely. The nearby tables are kind of like stopped for a second looking over, and some folks are like, hand over the back of the chair, like, huh? Ah. Oh man, this is, this is crazy. I never went, I didn't start doing performances in the casino. That's amazing. Yep, wrapped around his leg, he's hanging, not yeah. using his hands. You can see like some of the some of the sentries are like trying to gauge whether or not there's something to get involved with, but they're just kind of watching because nobody feels a, there's no aggression coming from it. I just do I smile upside yep. down at them. Uh as everyone's uh, about doing about <laughs> brass buns. The life. It's the, it's a classic. <laughs> Exandria <laughs> over. <laughs> This night is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> You've been in town for maybe a half an hour. <laughs> maybe. Clearly, we were a little wound up. Uh, Imogen, you were casting a tech thought. I was casting tech thoughts because on Landon. She's our mind freak. I know. Oh, no. oh, 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 come on. Uh, please leave the table. Wow, Lana. <laughs> This is the second Chris Ainge reference we've made on CR content in the past month, and I'm uncomfortable with it. <laughs> Chris, if you're a critter, I'm sorry. <laughs> you're fine. He's totally a critter. <laughs> 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 he cries somewhere. Cool. Do I mean, you don't claim to be an artisan of a old craft like woodworking if you're not one. If it's what he really wanted to do. He aspires to be. Yeah, and he didn't get to, and that's why. I'll he's... give him a test tomorrow. If he fails, you'll kill him. He's he dead. loses. A few, well, he loses maybe nice. I need to up the pedal to that. <laughs> <laughs> something less, but sure. He dies. <laughs> 
This was a great night. You know what would make it better? A shrimp cocktail tower. Wow. Get us one delivered to the room. Oh, yes. I saw on the menu right. that they, they do them in tears to represent the city. Yep. Cocktail <laughs> towers. We could all oh, shut our brains up. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome Bio, to EOS. Bio the city of flowing Ono. Oh, <laughs> that's why the light glows. It's just oh, saturated with chlorine. <laughs> 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 Pretty funny. It comes through the lake like a weird stuff. Oh, <laughs> 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 Why aren't you gonna have shrimp? I, I don't like it. The shrimp doesn't agree with me. Doesn't agree with your tum tum? No, no, it gets, it gets very weird. And you do not want to see what happens when I've got issues. Oh. <laughs> City of flowing shite. <laughs> it's gravel. Mm. Gravel pit. Just gravel. <laughs> Sandblast. Gravel. <laughs> 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 <A> shotgun. <laughs> <laughs> What are we doing? What is happening? What are we doing? Stop. Why do you do this to me? <laughs> it's the most beautiful location we've been building to coming here. And we can only make the most foul puns and gamble wantonly. <laughs> We're in the yeah, sky You guys yeah, yeah, touched yeah. the fucking city yet! <laughs> Hopefully we'll have our shit Where's that casino on the way to the You guys, you guys, you can't give us a casino! You guys, you guys, you guys, us a casino. still in the terminal! Yeah. <laughs> you haven't left the airport! Yeah. <laughs> this city is great! <laughs> Thank you for the short video. Like, it's it's got a Hudson News here! It's a window <laughs> it's been <Wow. laughs> It's been a long week on yeah, Earth yeah, One. Yeah, we just really needed to unwind a little yeah, and I'll send a message to Freya. Okay. Oh, we're being the worst. <laughs> Please send shrimp to our room. We will pay literally anything. <laughs> <laughs> just just don't tell. <laughs> just don't tell that we pay for them. <laughs> Anything. <laughs> it's just 25 anything. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. And then three tiers, room 14. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> the charcuterie plate shows up before the shrimp, but nevertheless, a small wooden cart does eventually arrive with a, like, haphazardly constructed three-plate arrangement of spiral-adjusted shrimp to the center um, under a, a bed of leafy greens with some sort of a cocktail sauce and, like, a brass bowl. It looks beautiful, if a little, like, rickety as they set it down. I will just very gently put, like, ten gold down. It's, it's gold. free, but the tip would be appreciated. It's very nice of you. Yeah, you just... ten gold yeah. for fucking shrimp. <laughs> 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 $3,000 yeah. <laughs> yep. We got some shitty pie <laughs> shit is purple. Could have bought a high-end laptop, but no, you got shrimp. <laughs> Uh, the true cost is just being assholes. <laughs> <laughs> not the worst shrimp. Yeah, probably are pretty bad. They're crawfish. Okay. They're crawfish. They're crawfish. Yeah. We are not this bad when we when we stay in a hotel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, this is this is pure fantasy. <laughs> was, was the shrimp guy also filming us? <laughs> 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 Oh, God. Why? Oh. Oh. Hashtag oh. 10 gold oh God. tipper. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. One day these people might save the world, <laughs> but tonight oh. they're getting the shrimp squirts. <laughs> uh, serious RPG. <laughs> Let's go. It's a fair amount for seven people. You can finish it at your own despair. Talk to him. Go make friends. This is important. Go okay. <laughs> like swoops down and then latches onto your shoulder and kind of looks up towards. They look at you like the skull, the the eye socket, just glaring in your direction with like the faint little spark of life in the deep canal of it. When we took the Laudna head head vacation, we saw the beginning idea of you, and uh, we really care about her, and it's important to keep her safe. I'll agree. Yeah, and I, I know you're going to be a lot of help there. Yeah, all costs. Gonna keep her safe. He 
Keep her alive, keep her kicking. And, she uh, goes, I go. Well, yeah, this so that we're all clear, and I'm really, I'm really happy that you're going to be helping. Well, since you appeared at a rather interesting moment in our reality, if that's you in there, Delilah, I swear to fuck that I will murder you if anything happens to her, and I'm watching. What? Are we clear? Okay. All right, otherwise we're good. Just thought that should be there. Protect her. Oh, Will. I like you. Spencer, <laughs> over to you. What the fuck was that? <laughs> I was probably quiet enough that I was trying to keep that a little in the corner, so. He's threatening me. He's Thank threatening you. Me. Oh, that's how, it, that's how Ashton makes friends. They're very friendly. It's just how they say they care. I'm gonna make you a fancy hat. It's gonna look great. <gasps> Apology accepted! Oh, no. you look so <laughs> it crawls back under your hair. All right. And I'll step back a little bit and I'll shut my eyes. And when I open them again, I won't be there. I'm gonna cast invisibility on myself. And I'm just gonna step out of the room and I'm gonna jump out of the window. And as I jump out, I'm gonna cast fly on myself. You being you, it's like just a small sound of like something landing on the windowsill. You go and glance over, but there's nothing there. Like as you look over at the windowsill, mm -hmm. you'll hear in your head, I'll be back. As you just dive off <laughs> the tower and see kind of the beautiful landscape beneath, the hundreds of people that are walking through the streets, the various arcane glowing lamp lights that line elements of the walking paths and the various buildings with long flags and banners that hang and blow gently with the breeze that pushes through. Quite a breeze, actually, that kind of continuously kicks through the city streets. Kind of Almost like a, a multi-tuned faint wood instrument that just kind of drifts through the city at different times. As that sound reaches your ears as you plummet towards the bottom, seeing the canals and the stonework and the people below, your invisibility fades as your flight kicks in and you <laughs> drift back up in control of your plummet. I'm gonna lie up and go up above the city and look down at everything, look down at the lake, and take in the lack of sound in my head, and I'm gonna cast Sending and try to contact my mother again. I'm in Eos. Are you here? I know you want to stay distant, but please, I need guidance, please. 45 grueling seconds of silence before your mother's voice comes back through towards you. If you're there, then you need to stay there. Stay safe. I understand the need for answers, but it's a real dangerous journey. She casts ending towards you. I've given up so much to keep you safe. At the end of it all, it's all alone, please. Mother, this storm is coming. If you keep running from me, I'm afraid I'm gonna get swept up in it. I know I'll find you in the end. If you keep running towards me, you'll definitely end up swept up in it. Imogen, run. I don't respond. I'm just gonna stay up above the city for a while before I fly back down. There's a sound that pierces the air. Oh no. <laughs> Wait, what? <gasps> I'm gonna glance up, and there's like these gargoyle crypt creatures that are built up on the side of front of the building, but they're perched up in the back of the shadow. You see some sort of avian creature that begins to curve its head out of the shadow. You see this long, hooked, kind of somewhat scar gnarled beak. It's kind of cloudy eye, inside. patches inside. of missing you feather. Right you know what's wrong! What wrong? <laughs> this is not. And it immediately inside trains right in on you. What do you. You got to inside. Be inside. Ah! No! Wow! And that's a rant. Oh! 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 It's the only way you could end an episode this <laughs> ridiculous. <laughs> yep. <laughs> It's just legitimately. Oh Not actually, but Sam one cloudy eye this. digging into my forearm. She should have found you. It's been tracking me for thousands of miles. You shouldn't have flown so high. This pigeon is gonna oh fuck God. you up. Oh. Two dollars. I want my two dollars. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Wow. Yep. What a we perfect episode. <laughs> what a perfect oh episode. That was great. That, that was might so be one much of our fun. greatest episodes. <laughs> that was oh an absolute fucking blast. Oh, and <laughs> Lake Seven. I was, I don't apologies know. for the chaos for those who that couldn't was, follow, but God, we were having fun. That got, uh, yeah, that got wonderful. Not heard. a shopping episode. No. But something else. <laughs> something <laughs> else it was. Something else. But yeah, the heist. I believe we'll pick up from there next week, which I think will be our last episode of the year. Oh! Right? oh. No, no. That'll be our 
our holiday, our holiday send off. But yeah, uh, so are we all wearing like ugly sweaters? What are we doing? Oh yeah, we should definitely holiday. Oh, yeah. We'll coordinate. Yeah. We'll figure it out. We'll wear pajamas. Yeah. Oh, I love pajamas. Yeah. Sweaters. We'll figure it out. Travis wears a t-shirt. Yeah. You know, like a t-shirt with a Santa Claus on. Fantastic on. No. Oh yeah, best of. We could just attach little reindeer between them, and you could pretend to be Santa Claus with this. Yeah, that's true. Mm. That's a pretty. That's a reuse right that's, there. That's a nightmare. Is what that is. Yes, the worst. But yeah, we'll call it there. Thank you so much for joining us for this absolute batshit chaos. We love you very much, and we'll sit Thursday. Good night. Yeah.